Thank you for taking the time to view AlignStar's feature tutorial about linking to a data source. In this video, we will learn how to establish a link to an outside data source, how to use a linked data source to apply existing alignment information to a document, and how to link to data sources at different levels of geography and with different types of information. AlignStar can easily establish a link to your outside data in many commonly used data formats. This allows you to use the information already stored in one or more places. Outside data links are required to take advantage of most of AlignStar's features, including the optimizer and the territory expert. By linking to outside data, you can perform the following. Apply existing alignment information to a document. View your data at various summary levels. Balance your territories using your data as a guide. Perform optimizations using outside data. Run the territory expert. Locate your current field personnel. Generate reports and create charts with your data. And map the geographic distribution of your data. There are several different kinds of data that you may want to link to in AlignStar. Here is an example of some of the various data that people commonly use for territory design, alignment, and analysis. Territory alignment or assignment information, also referred to as zip to tear or a zip tear file. Market potential data, workload data, sales data, demographic data, or personnel information, including locations, names, quotas, and email addresses. The process of linking to outside data is simple and straightforward. In each AlignStar document, you can link to 10 data sources, plus an additional data source containing your personnel information. There are two steps to link to a file. First, you need to identify the file name and location so that AlignStar can find it. Second, you need to establish a geographic reference between your linked data and your AlignStar document. You can establish a link between the data source and one of the available map layers using map unit codes such as zip codes or county FIPS codes. Another option is to identify the fields containing the latitude and longitude coordinates in your linked data. You should select the New Document Wizard tool from the toolbar. The AlignStar Document Wizard appears. You should then click the Link to a Data Source button, locate the file you would like to link, highlight the file to select it, and click Open. The Data Source Field Mapping window will appear. Next, you can select a link from the drop-down boxes provided. If AlignStar recognizes the title of a header in your file, it will select it for you. After pressing OK, the map selection window will show four options related to linking the data, such as modifying the alignment or linking accounts. You should determine which option is suitable and press OK. The data will be mapped to the selected layer in AlignStar or via latitude and longitude positions. You can manage your linked data sources at any time using the link maintenance tool or the data link maintenance command. This allows you to add new data sources to your document, remove linked data sources from your document, change the geocode field used for linking, set up a link containing your personnel information, or to set up label fields. The data source links are saved with the documents. AlignStar will relink when the document is opened.